Hi, in this video I'm going to talk about a project that I have been working on for the past few days. It's a network controlled MP3 player based on the ESP8266 module. What I like about the ESP8266 is that it's a Wi-Fi module, uh, but at the same time it's got a built-in microcontroller and some GPIOs that I can get access to. So it's a very nice small package um, that minimizes my component counts if I'm building a project. So the only thing I need to get this project working is a MP3 player that I can control using the ESP8266 module. So just such a uh, MP3 module I found through AliExpress was the Cadillac uh, MP3 player. It takes a micro SD card, uh, it has no buttons, it has an audio jack and I have four pins over here which are an interface uh, two pins for the power. I have the TX and RX, which is a UART that can be controlled from the ESP8266. So let's just quickly wire this up and then we can do a demonstration showing it operational. So let me zoom out a bit. Okay. So the cabling couldn't be simpler. I'm just going to first connect the power like this. I'm going to have green for ground, VCC as blue, and then I'm going to have orange for TX, transmit. Doing that. So I have VCC and ground, VCC, TX, RX, and then I have to do the connect this up on the other side. So green for ground, there. Blue for my VCC. Let's just double check. And then my RX on here is yellow, which should be the TX on the ESP8266, since we have to cross them in my TRX here is going to be the orange pin. Okay, so that's pretty much it. That's all wired up, ready. I just need to power up the ESP8266 module and I should have a network controllable MP3 player. Now, one thing missing is obviously I need to have a memory card. So I'm just going to put that over here first. I'm going to power up the ESP8266 using a USB power bank, insert the SD card. As soon as I insert the SD card, you can see there is a power LED that is on. So I have a speaker that I'm just gonna put here. I'm gonna zoom out a bit more. Okay. And And I have a low powered amplifier which is off screen. It's not part of this project, so I'm just going to leave it out of the picture. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to use my phone to control this device. So let's just browse to the MP, uh, to the ESP8266, and it's running a web server on there. And let's just simply hit play. So the web interface has just some of the uh, features that I have implemented for this module. Uh, I'll do another video which goes into more details on the programmatic side of this. And all the links for the code to run on the ESP8266 
that control the mp3 player are going to be in the links which are on github thank you thank you for watching